What if the cure for disease was not a drug, yet a concept? The power of the alkaline body. Hello everyone, I am Michael and I help guide people on their evolutionary journey. Disease cannot flourish in an alkaline environment. Disease, including cancer, flourishes in an acidic environment. In 1931, Dr. Otto Warburg won the Nobel Peace Prize sharing the consciousness that disease, including cancer, cannot grow in an alkaline environment. Cancer only grows in an acidic environment. This is important consciousness that everyone should be aware of. We want to keep our body's pH level above seven once it drops below seven and the environment of your body becomes acidic, disease can flourish, cancer can grow. Disease is not being sick. We will all become sick, but we have an immune system to rid it. Bacteria, viruses always will invade our body. But if we keep our body alkaline, making it an alkaline environment, disease cannot flourish. We will regenerate and heal. Cancer and disease flourish in an acidic environment. Dr. Otto Warburg understood this in 1931. We should all be conscious of his findings. This was back in 1931. How many of you have heard of Dr. Otto Warburg? We should all be grateful for his knowledge. So we should be conscious by staying away from foods that make our body and blood acidic. All processed foods, processed meats, fast foods, we should be conscious of this. Everyone has the right to live the way that they want to live and eat whatever they want to eat, but they also have the right for consciousness. They should be aware of the difference between alkaline and acidic and what it means for your body. Ways that we can become alkaline is by drinking alkaline water and consuming fruits and vegetables, higher amounts of fruits and vegetables on my journey my diet has been changing and in the past I did not consume the amount of fruits and vegetables that I do today this time period is about unlearning and relearning I'm on my journey just like you I was not born with all the knowledge people have shared we are all sharing and we're raising the vibration of this planet we should all be conscious that cancer grows in an acidic environment, but not in a body that provides an alkaline environment. Another way you could add a teaspoon of baking soda to water and drink a glass of water with baking soda in it in the morning, also helpful. Do your own research as always light warrior we are here expanding consciousness so we are all entitled to consume the foods that we want to as long as we are making a conscious decision and we are all aware of what we are putting in our bodies but let's be conscious of the power of the alkaline body we have all lost loved ones to cancer I am out here defending and avenging our loved ones that have fallen to this disease as we rid it, remove it from this planet along with other lower vibrations. Remember, 
We cannot control what is around us. However, we can control from within. Be conscious of the power of the alkaline body. Raise your vibration and increase your electromagnetism. Life is so much better when we are all together. If you find this message inspiring or know someone that could benefit from it, please share this message. I am Michael. Find us in the fifth dimension. Have a wonderful day living your everyday life. Let's improve everyone's everyday life, the physical and mental health for all. Share this message over and over again. Let's heal the people of this planet. Let's avenge those that have fallen from cancer. Let us all be conscious of the findings of Dr. Otto Warburg that cancer cannot grow in an alkaline environment. I am the defender of our everyday lives. Victory of the light. Dr. Otto Warburg, the power of the alkaline body.